Hello, everybody. This is my review of King's Game, Episode 8. Spoilers here. If not watch this episode, fuck you. Not so cool. Alright, spoilers. Alright, and foul language will be used in this one. Alright, if any of uh, people are like, trying to show their kids, do not show your kids this one. I will be using language that is not meant for children. Fewer discretion is advised. Oh, Lord, Natsuko. Oh, my God. She raped Tanagawa. Or whatever the name is. The, you know, the barber. Yeah, I was like, oh, my God. She is playing with the condom. Like, mm-hmm. I'm like, oh, oh, que cochina, pinche perra puta. Pinche prostituta golfa. Pinche prostituta golfa. Pinche prostituta golfa. That's what she is, okay? Pinche prostituta puta golfa. Pinche prostituta golfa. Say it, oh, yeah, it's fine. But I was like, ooh, and she's calling, what's the name? Mm-hmm, I got your phone. And she got his phone. So she, the thing is, she blocks the number of any of them. Nubuki, Tago, they're dead right away. You block it because it's like, oh, you you know, you have, you messed up, in, you know, you have uh, broken the rules. But now, what happens? Riona calls him. She's fine. She's cute. Hello. And they want to talk, and he's like, okay, I'm kind of busy, I'm nowhere near the town. So she tells him about the King's Game. Other King's Game, that she thinks there have been other ones. And then she knows that Atsuko probably played one before, and then he did. And then she mentions uh, Rai. And he's like, he's like, triggered, like, how do you know her? How do you know? And then I, don't, I forgot, like, get a grip of yourself, like, how do you know? And then she tells him the whole thing, like, yeah gave him a notebook from the first King's Game he played. He's like, yeah, there was a letter after everyone died on their phone. He put it together. It was a message. He had to figure it out. And then it said, uh, destroy the world or something like that. And then, uh, keep playing or be punished at the end, he tells her. So now there's a new game where on your left hand, you get negative points, but you have to main or... Oh, right there, I'm like, this is going to be cringy. Because the thing is, mind you, they're not going flashback no more. Like, they're not doing it. Well, they are going to flashback. Well, the thing is, I read the manga, so I already know what happens. And I was like, no! So, the thing is, they have to either pass and hope that everyone doesn't do it because they'll get the negative points. Left hand's negative, this one's positive. And, uh, you got to break a thumb or something like that. I'm like, oh, or break your fingers. I'm like, whoo! It was cringy. So, next... They're like, uh, Taragawa telling, well, he's like, would you like a haircut? Because everyone's passing. Pass, pass, pass. And then he's giving him a haircut. A haircut. Yeah. Well, he gave him a good trim, you know what I mean? The next thing you know, he broke his thumb! Oh, shoot. Oh, he did it on the positive side. And then next thing you know, he's like, he's like, what? Give me back my phone! Because he wants their phones back because she can block them and they both die automatically. So she trades it. He's like, oh, I'll give you all. And then after, she, oh, that was the plan. Because everyone's in on it. They want not to go dead. And because he breaks a finger and nobody was like, no. Nah! And then he's like, ah. I'm like, oh, shoot, he's breaking his own hand. Well, anyway, yeah, I mean, there's more in the next episode. Because, whew. Spoilers if you, oh, all right. oh, please cover a thumbs up and tell me, what did you guys think about it? Were you like, because when they did the, I was like, either break them or come, I'm like, whoa, oh, hell no, we ain't play that time again. Anyway, uh, take care.